Assalamu alaikum my dear students how are you hope you are fine by the grace of almighty allah welcome to NIBS home school this is shahjadi akhtar assistant teacher of science of national ideal english version school day shift today i am going to take a general class general science class for class 1 students my dear students our today's topic chapter 4 discuss and page number uh, 27 to 29 our today's lecture number 7 and is chapter number 5 my dear students let's start our class my dear students at first take your science book this book and follow this class with your textbook our today's topic chapter 4 parts of a plants okay we'll uh, today we'll discuss this chapter chapter 4 parts of a plant okay at first we will discuss <coughs> the different parts of a plant and the function of that parts okay today we will discuss about uh, the different parts of a plant and the function of that parts okay like us a plant too has different parts like us plants have also different parts look at the picture below to know about the different parts of a plant okay my dear students look at this picture and uh, we'll uh, know the different parts of these plants okay you can see a uh, plant the figure of a plant here here given this is root okay this part is called root now see this part this is called stem okay see this part this is fruit this is a fruit see this part this is called leaf and see this one this one is flower okay my dear students so <coughs> we have learned this is root this is stem this is fruit this is leaf and this is flower these are the different parts of a plant okay now come to next page parts of the plant some parts of plant grow above the soil some parts underline this one some parts of the plant grow above the soil some parts of the plant grow under the soil and the main part of most plants are root stem leaf and flower okay my dear students the main part of plants are root stem leaf and flower okay now we'll discuss the function of these parts okay stem of a plant is if stem of a plant is present above the ground okay we'll uh, know this is stem this part is called stem and this part is present above the ground understood stem is present above the ground it gives support the underline this one and memorize you have to memorize the underline okay this line is important line it gives support to the plant stem gives support to the plant this is the function of stem it holds the branches leaves fruits and flowers stem ho stem holds the branches leaves fruits and flowers okay it carries food and water to all parts of the plant stem of a tree is thick and hard and we call it a trunk my dear students the all this line are very very important and you have to memorize this line okay what is the function of stem stem of a plant is above the ground uh, it gives support to the plant uh, stem gives hold the branches leaves fruits and flowers and stem carries food and water to all the parts of the plants okay stem of a tree is thick and hard and we call it trunk okay now come to leaves what is the function of leaves leaves of a plant is present above the ground leaf also present above the ground okay now they may leaf make food for the plant okay this is the function of leaves 
they make food for the plant now come to root okay this is the part of root and we'll dis uh, discuss now the function of root roots of a plant grow under the ground roots of a plant grow under the ground this is ground and root grow under the ground roots give support to the plant okay this is the function of root root gives support to the plant these carry water and other things that a plant needs uh, from the soil okay the function of root is it support to the plant and root carry water and other things that a plant need from the soil now come to flower flowers grow on the branches or stem of a plant and flowers is the most beautiful part of a plant we know this is flower okay flower is the most beautiful part of the plant and it changes into a fruit okay flower changes into fruit now come to fruit fruits are very useful for us most fruits have seeds inside them okay most fruits have seeds inside them suppose mango okay mango fruits have seeds inside uh, them uh, inside the mango okay plants grow from seeds plants grow from seeds okay now come to next page stem is known as the backbone of the plant my dear students this is the important line stem stem is known as the backbone of the plant and leaf is called the kitchen of the plant leaf is called the kitchen of the plant why leaf is called the kitchen of the plant because leaf make food for the plants okay leaf make food for the plants that's why leaf is called the kitchen of the plant and points to remember my dear students these lines uh, is very very important line and you have to memorize also this line the main part of most plants are root stem leaf and flower okay the main part of the most plants are root stem leaf and flower the part growing above the ground is stem the part growing below the ground is root we have learned here from the part growing above the ground is called stem and the part growing above uh, uh, below the ground is called root the leaves make food for the plant okay and most fruits have seeds inside them flowers are the most beautiful part of the plant okay now uh, come to fill in the blanks okay number one i carry who am i at first who am i number one i carry water and other things the plants need uh, from the soil i am the i carry water and other things uh, uh, the plants need from the soil i am the my dear students what will be and uh, we'll know this uh, answer from uh, this discussion it will be root okay root here the uh, function of root root carry water and other things that from the plants need from the soil okay it will be root so write root number two i change into fruit of the plant i am the flower okay here flower changes into fruits okay flower f l o w e r flower number 3 i live inside the fruit i am the seed okay i am the seed it will be seed number 4 i keep the plant straight i am the backbone of the plant i am the dash what will be it will be stem is stay the function of stem is the it is uh, the straight and it is the backbone we, say, uh, we know this stem is known as the backbone of a plant that means it will be stem okay now 
last one i cook food for the plant i am the leaf okay i am the leaf it will be leaf and now uh, come to that uh, next page draw arrow the parts of the plant color the picture okay draw arrow the parts of the plant stem what will be the stem which one is stem this one is stem okay and draw arrow the stem okay the that parts flower which one is flower this one is flower okay and leaf this one is leaf root this one is root okay okay my dear students <coughs> our today's sw number is 5 and page number it will be page number 29 fill in the blanks my dear students do this fill in the blanks as your sw and submit it on saturday my dear students i hope you have understood our today's topic uh, memorize properly our today's topic and, and keep and keep practicing at home uh, do this sw properly and submit regularly see you again in the next class allah hafiz